Many people asking where's the money after a possible big change for North Carolina homeowners. Insurance companies were asking the state to let them raise premium rates by an average of 42%. Yeah, the North Carolina Insurance Commissioner shot that down, but a rate still has to be decided, and it is unclear how high it might be. And all of this comes as a new report shows homeowners insurance in North Carolina is already $500 higher than the national average. WCNC Charlotte's Anna King is joining us live tonight. So Anna, you got a chance to speak with the insurance commissioner. What did he tell you? That's right, I did. I spoke to him earlier today and he told me calls and emails came in quickly with people asking for this not to take place. So he put a stop to it. But until October, the final fate of those rate hikes is up in the air. They all said, no, please don't raise our homeowners insurance. We're struggling as it is to pay for the high cost of groceries and fuel. Our taxes have gone up. Insurance companies asked to raise home insurance by more than 40 percent in North Carolina. But tonight, North Carolina Insurance Commissioner Mike Causey is pushing back. I heard the people loud and clear. And after reviewing the rate filing, it was my opinion that the rates requested were excessive and unfairly discriminatory. So I said no. This rate hike would be the first one since 2020. Causey says the highest rate hike would have been along North Carolina's coast. In Mecklenburg County, the proposed plans would have raised prices by more than 41 percent. The Department of Insurance and I received more than 25,000, 25,000 letters, emails, and sometimes phone calls from the people of all across North Carolina. Most of those came from the coastal counties in North Carolina. Cause he says he's waiting to hear if the insurance companies come up with a compromise. If not, the two sides are scheduled to go to court in October to find one. Now, Causey says if anyone has any questions or concerns in regard to their insurance, you can simply reach out to them. And to find out how to do that, you can head to our website at WCNC.com. In Charlotte, Anna King, WCNC Charlotte.